Good bugger. And there comes airspeed. No scare steering. It's on. Smoke is on. 150, we're up. Um, hi, folks. I'm Captain Quest here. Call sign is cloud when I'm flying virtual aircraft in BMS. What I'd like to do in this video is introduce you to um, the WDP or Weapons Delivery Planner for Falcon BMS. Uh, this is a great tool. So right now what I'm going to do is without even talking much I'm going to show you what a great benefit this is. Now those of you that are familiar with playing BMS you, you know that typically when you want to fly a mission whether it be TE or campaign uh, multiplayer or single you basically have to go in there and plan out your mission each time you have to show your threat circles and all your structures and targets designate your targets to their steer points set up your data cartridge preset your uh, airport tower radio frequencies and all that kind of stuff it can be very time consuming before you actually get in there and fly and the worst part about it is that you have to do that each time you fly that mission uh, the WDP will will cut all of that very short and I'll show you how it works uh, I'm going to implement the workaround and I'm not going to explain very much I'm just going to show you how quick it is first I'm just going to start my game I don't know if you can see my cursor uh, probably not recording my cursor alright my game has started believe it or not and I'm gonna go ahead and pick a mission and this could be a multiplayer mission or single player or whatever I'm just picking a single player saved mission in campaigns this one I call the power plant mission the power plant is not actually the primary target that's what I and as you know you would spend some time here in the UI setting up your mission alright now I don't have to do that all I have to do is go ahead and pick the flight package that I want to be I'm going to be the lead in Viper 1 strike package and the package number make a note is 12134 I'm going to make a note of that now I'm going to alt tab out of the game and open up my weapons delivery planner And I'm going to open that same mission up. Power plant. Now I've got to find that flight. It was 12134. And the Viper package is the only one in that package. Now when this comes up, I'm going to say no. Now look at all, and, and here I'm just going to confirm that my loadout is correct this will not you can't change your loadout in here this is just to confirm that it's the way you have it so that it can calculate performance uh, properly all right here's my data card has been generated with incredibly valuable information about this flight this is basically what the real pilot would have on his kneeboard okay now I'm going to go ahead and go back into my game and I am NOT going to designate targets or bring up the threat circles or even preset anything in my data cartridge I'm just going to hit take off and while I'm on this page where you select okay, ramp taxi or runway, I'm going to alt tab out again and now I'm going to click the DTC button and confirm and now I'm going to go back to my game Engaging target bullseye, 035, 160 miles, 25,000. And as you know, we'll have to wait this out a little bit. Oh, shoot! Satan, 1, we are RTB. Cowboy, 2, 1. Engaging target bullseye, 065, 100 miles, 22,000. If you see a black screen, don't panic. 
there we are. We are in the pit, and as you can see, all my settings are preset, even even down to the color of my HUD, my EWS settings, and I will show you that our, my threat circles, and although we may not be able to see it, my target has already been designated for me. What I'll do is I'll go ahead and scale out on the HSD. Just do it this way. And you'll see, we'll confirm that sure enough, my thread circles and my target will be seen on the HSD. I am ready to fly, folks. Nothing more to be done but take off. It doesn't get any easier than that. So if you're interested in using this thing, go ahead and watch the rest of the video and I'll explain 